Are you looking for a place to walk, run, bike, or even go horseback riding? The Bay Colony Rail Trail could be the answer. The project would convert seven miles of unused train tracks from Needham Junction to Medfield into a community recreational path. Here is Heather Baker with more. The proposed path offers many benefits to the community. There are also many details yet to be determined. We expect that each town will have uh, an advisory board uh, that will be looking after uh, the decisions and, and uh, the process. And uh, we'd expect uh, that advisory board to, to let us know what the town wants regarding you know, a lot of things about access to the trail, about the surface of the trail, uh, bylaws, rules, could dogs be on the trail, for example. Um, so there's lots of decisions to be made, and we expect that to come out of the towns, because this is really a, a community resource. It's not, it's not a private resource. Some rail trails have been in development for more than 20 years. Expected completion of this conversion is merely a fraction of that time. We're hoping that we can get this done in uh, six years or less. Um, we're, gonna, we're in a current phase of, of uh, the first couple of years. We just want to build awareness to work with uh, the local towns, to let them know that we've got this project going and, uh, and to learn kind of what residents would like from their rail trail. The Bay Colony Rail Trail is on track to connect the towns of Needham, Dover, and Medfield. Most towns find is that it's a great community builder. It's where you go out and you, and you meet your town, your fellow townspeople. And um, so it really becomes part of the identity of town. So there's lots of studies now that show neighbors uh, and residents and towns um, are really benefit from a rail trail. It's a place not only, you know, it's a place to get exercise, it's a place to get out uh, into nature. It's a great alternative transportation. Government funding is available for this project, but it's expected to increase both time and cost of the conversion. Organizers hope to pursue private funding instead. The Bay Colony Rail Trail received its first corporate sponsorship from one local business. We were really fortunate to, uh, to get a uh, generous donation from Needham Bank in May for $10,000. That is uh, to help us do this phase we're in right now, which is to uh, build awareness, to, you know, reach out to towns, uh, people in the towns, and let them know what we're doing, and then begin the, the conversation about how to make this trail work for them. Um, and I was uh, so gratified by the bank and uh, the president, Jack McGeorge in particular, who really got the vision, saw this as a great community resource. For more information about this project, go to www.baycolonyrailtrail.org. For the Needham Channel News, I'm Heather Baker.